braked piling using grippers. Guidance and quality control using Teledyne PDS. Teledyne PDS already supports multiple methods of piling, such as placement of mono piles and piling by use of a pile slider. In this new supported method, the pile is placed in two grippers, which can move in the X and Y direction. On this way the pile can be placed in the required raked position. PDS will read from a spreadsheet the design pile position and inclination, and calculates the real values in real time using the measurements of two laser scanners. Different views are added in the acquisition screen layout, to guide and provides in quality control during the piling process. A report is generated when the piling is accomplished. Let's start to have a look to the PDS acquisition. In acquisition, we guide the piling and have our quality control by using different views. In this example, we created a simple layout with views you might use. At first, the control view. From the control view we can load a pile spreadsheet containing the design pile positions, inclinations, and other parameters for the piles to be placed. From the loaded spreadsheet, we could select a pile. The selected pile is the pile to be placed and becomes the reference in the other views. The designed information of the selected pile is shown. Furthermore, offers the control view, filter settings, for the lasers to detect the pile more efficient. The laser detections can be monitored in the laser detection views. A report is generated when the pile placed button is pressed, containing the as placed information. Or to define and generate a statistic report, to show graphically selected data, over a defined period. PDS offers various bull size views to guide the vessel or the piling. In this example a dynamic positioning view is added. But also possibly the plan view construction bullseye is used. Or to guide the vessel, the plan view, vessel placement bullseye view to indicate the current position and the design position of the vessel read from the spreadsheet. This to position the vessel as optimal as possible. Any data value can be shown as an indicator, aiding in precise guidance. In this example, multiple indicators are added in the bars horizontal view. In the bars horizontal view are the indicators defined from the view and layer control. Right click in the view and click on the view and layer control menu button. The view and layer control dialog opens. Click on the plus symbol to add an indicator. In this example there are already multiple indicators added. Double click on an added indicator to edit its properties. Select the item to indicate from the source item list. Set the indication coloring and the relative value attribute. Usually relative to zero is selected. Set the data name format. This is the name shown under the indicator. In this example we added indicators to monitor the pile heading error, the inclination error, and our position errors. The values are computed from the PDS piling driver and makes accurate pile placement possible. Next, the 3D view online dredge construction, showing the piling in 3D. In this simple example project, the 3D view show the designed piles in orange, the selected pile in blue, the current pile in the grippers, as detected by the lasers in gray, the upper in lower gripper in yellow and purple, and the so-called fixed gripper in blue. The fixed gripper is used as an aid to position the vessel in case there is not yet a pile in the gripper. The vessel itself and away line from the designed position to the current position of the pile are also shown. The coloring of all components can be changed from the view in layer control. 
Furthermore, the 3D view offers the same functionality as the other 3D views in PDS. This means additional layers can be added to show additional information. Next, the plan view dredge construction operation view. This view show the same information as the 3D view, but now in 2D. The design piles, the current pile position, a way line, the grippers, and the vessel. In this view or in the 3D view a pile can also be selected by double clicking on it. The plan view offers the same functionality as the other plan views in PDS. This means you can add charts, DXF drawings, grid models, routes, and more to the view. Essential for the raked pile guidance are the laser measurements. The laser detection views gives a clear indication how good the pile is detected. The white lines represents the laser beams. The valid detections are marked green in the quality bar. The filter settings in the control bar are used to improve the detection of the pile by the lasers. A detection gate can be created by drawing a polygon around the pile. Detections falling outside the polygon are ignored. Right click in the laser detection view to draw a polygon and select the polygon in the control view to act as a detection gate. The heading calibration of a laser is important, otherwise position errors in the pile drive guidance occur. Dot the laser detection view is equipped with a quick laser heading calibration feature. The laser heading is calibrated against a pipe on a fixed location. Prior to start the heading calibration, first the calibration parameters must be set in the device driver properties of the laser device. The properties are accessible from the vessel configuration equipment page or from the raw data view or from the help desk view. Open the help desk view from the help menu. Double click on the laser device data node to open the properties in real time. Set in the properties roughly the needed heading correction. The offset of the calibration object. This offset is measured up in the vessel frame with respect to the vessel zero offset point. Set the radius of the calibration object and the filter tolerance value. If all these properties are set correctly, then the laser will detect the calibration object. This is indicated by the purple colored beams. Press on the calibration symbol to calibrate the laser heading. The heading correction value is automatically applied to the driver properties and the laser data is corrected accordingly. In this movie we have seen quickly the views and tools PDS offers to guide raked piling. More detailed information, as well as how to set up a project is described in the raked pile driving guidance with two laser scatters manual. Or contact Teledyne PDS support.